everybody and welcome back to my channel. I thought I would vlog today because it is my first day. Do you want to be in the video? I thought I would vlog today because it is my first day back at the gym and I am so excited. Honestly, my um, expectations for the gym in my building are not high. I'm expecting it to be like a treadmill and some free weights, but honestly that's better than working on my apartment. And it'll do for now until I get my legit gym membership in January. And I'm also doing some like Pilates inspired workouts right now on Wednesdays, but I'm excited. I'm gonna film my workout for you guys and it should be good. It should be good. I'm so excited. And Millie has puppy school today. Don't you? Puppy school again? Are you excited? She's getting so big guys. Like, look, at, look at her. She's freaking huge. I can't wait to find out how much she weighs on Friday because I feel like she's definitely gained weight. Like I'm guessing she weighs like 15 pounds, <laughs> maybe 12. I feel like 14. I don't know. She's definitely like put on some pounds recently and her coat's changing. You're just becoming an adult before my eyes. But if you're new here, my name is Chelsea. Welcome to my channel. And let's get into the workout soon. I guess I can show you guys my outfit. So I'm wearing a sweater because I'm freezing, but I do have a workout outfit. Oh, is that a big yawn? You're gonna have a nappy in your crate for a bit while I'm gone, so you'll enjoy that, won't you? Yeah, there it is. It's like, you know, she's tired. When she's tired, her ears go to the side. When she's awake, her ears are straight up. <laughs> okay, so this is what I'm wearing. This t-shirt is from Gymshark. The leggings are also from Gymshark. These are the Apex seamless leggings in burgundy. I think they're so nice. This is, oh my God, what is this shirt called? I forget, but it's like a crop tee. I got it on a Black Friday sale. And then I'm just wearing the Roosh sports bra underneath. And I'm just gonna wear some like white training sneakers and I'm ready to go. Got my Apple Watch on so I can track my fitness for today and my steps. Though I get like eight billion steps in with this one. We go outside a lot and run around in circles with you. I don't know what she's staring at. Oh, that light beam on the, there's a light beam on the ceiling and she's staring at it. I think it's from my camera. Yeah. Oh, it's gone. It's back. It's gone. It's back. <laughs> but yeah, I'll see you guys at the gym. in my teeth. I just finished a build bar. Um, that workout was so good. It was just so nice to have an hour again to just focus on myself. Like working out for me, it's half fitness, half like for my mental health. Like I just love working out. I'm really so cute. I'm just boiling her freaking chicken right now. Every time I vlog myself, she barks and I think it's for attention. Are you needy? Or I just ignore her because training 101, your dog barks at you. Mm-mm. 
you ignore. They do not need that kind of attention. It's not necessary, it's demanding. Anyways, boiling some chicken for Millie's puppy school. She goes to at 12, it's like 10.30 right now. And I'm just so happy that I got to work out. It was so nice. I also got, one second, let me show you. I also ordered Millie's, well it came in the mail, Millie's big girl leash and collar. I know what you're thinking, this looks like it's for a boy dog. I know. Um, I just don't like the girly colors and I love green and I thought this one was really pretty. So if everyone thinks she's a boy, that's fine. You know, like pink just doesn't go with orange fur. It doesn't. Green would look nice. So I got this one, it's by the brand Wilder Dog and it's actually made of this like waterproof material. So I just thought it'd be great for like long lasting for like the winters here and the spring because it's really disgusting in Canada. Like the weather, everything's muddy and like dog stuff just gets destroyed. This is waterproof and it's made of like a silicone product. So it's very easy to clean. So I thought long term, this would be a lot better. Also, she can like swim in it. She can do whatever. So I picked up this one and then I also got the matching leash in the same color green. This one's like a six foot leash, so it seems really long because right now I walk her on a four foot leash, I think. So this seems like huge, but she'll upgrade to this eventually. <laughs> she should be trained by the time this fits her. But I hope you guys are excited to have the workout content back in the vlogs. I'm really excited about it and I'm just so happy that the gym is now available to me, especially for Vlogmas this December. I feel like that's gonna make my life so much better because I can get some workout content in the vlogs as well. And I'm just like so excited for Vlogmas to start. Like I'm like, like I just wanted to hurry up. Like I'm like done with regular vlogging now. I'm ready for Vlogmas. I'm fully prepared. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna boil the chicken and then I'll show you guys Millie at puppy school because it's always so cute. <laughs> back. I took Millie to puppy school. I had lunch. I just had some leftovers, which were amazing, but I'm about to take Millie out again. We're going to go outside. I'm all bundled up. As you can tell, it literally became winter overnight and it's freezing here now. Like so freaking cold. I ordered mittens off Amazon. So I'm waiting for them to come. They're like, once I can take the fingers, the fingers can come out for walking the dog. Cause you got open poo bags and stuff. You know, <laughs> I'm a dog mom. Now. I carry a dog purse. I'm like a legit, legit dog mom. I look like a dog walker or something. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna take her out now. I like to go out at this time because it's like pre the sun setting and it's just nice to like be outside again before it gets really dark out. So let's go outside. I'll probably play with her a bit too, because why not? in my morning and a bit of doing my Pilates. Well, just me there. But I thought I would do a little unboxing haul because a bunch of stuff that I ordered all came at the same time. So I thought, why not? It's all winter gear, <laughs> literally. Because um, this year I will have to go out no matter what the weather, because I know I'm a dog mom. So I will have to walk my dog even if it is a blizzard and freezing. I don't get the luxury of staying indoors. So I did get some warm winter essentials and i did do a little bit of black friday shopping as well which i'm about to show you guys from this package right here which is from american eagle well airy so i got some fleece like quarter zips i've been obsessed with fleece because i'm always freezing 
and it's getting colder and colder here in Canada. So I was like, I need some warm stuff. So I picked up these little quarter zips. They were on sale for like 40% off, I think. So the first one I just got in this really nice like charcoal black color. I actually didn't have one in black. I really like this. I got everything in an extra, extra small because their stuff is super oversized. And this looks like it's gonna fit perfect. Love it, gonna wear this with like leggings, etc. I just love cozy items like that. And then I also picked up a pair of leggings from Airy. I have never tried these ones, but they looked super like warm and just different than what I normally have. So they're like a ribbed color, ribbed color material. And they're in this like gray color, super thick. And they have this little cute button detail on the leg, but these are so thick. Like these will definitely keep your legs warm in the winter. So I loved these. I thought they were really nice and they were on sale. And then I picked up another fleece, same one as the gray one, but I got it in this reddish color. I don't have anything in this color. So I was like, why not? Why not get it? Yeah. So this one has a bit of a different collar. It's got like, like this padding kind of stuff around it, but it's another little quarter zip sweatshirt. Super cute. I'm so excited to wear these. They're just gonna be so cozy and comfy for this winter. Then I have to get a new pair of pajamas for Christmas. I'm so excited because for Christmas this year, I'm actually spending it at Aiden's house. Just because with Millie, it's easier. My dogs still aren't 100% used to Millie. So we have to like warm them up slowly because my parents' dogs are not like 100% good with other dogs. They're very pick and choosy. They're very like slow to be accepting. So we're kind of building that up before we bring her into the house and just like let her be there. You guys know what I mean? So we're building it up slowly. So anyways, I'm staying at Aiden's this year and I picked up a new pair of Christmas pajamas. I bought a pair of these last year or maybe I got them for Christmas, I cannot remember, but I wanted to get like a red pair. So this is so freaking cute. I love their jogger style because it's, it doesn't like ride up the same way regular pajama pants do. And these are just so nice. I got them in an extra small. And then the top is just this nice flannel button up. So cute, so festive. I love it. And like, I just wanted new pajamas. I'm such like a cozy pajama person. So that really is perfect. And then last up, I just got this sweater, which I thought looked so comfortable. Apparently it's super oversized. So I'm hoping that it'll be fine. I did order it in a small. Oh, it'll be perfect. Okay, so I got this in an extra, extra small and it's like this crew neck or mock neck, gray sweatshirt that says Alaska on it. I'm reading, what's it called? Alaska Wild or no? Is that what it's called? I've been reading it again. I remember I recommended this book to you guys a while ago and I'm rereading it right now because I don't know why. I just felt like it just got me. I just felt like reading it again. And then I saw the sweater and I was like, I need an Alaska sweater. So that's everything that I got from Aries Black Friday sale. And then, I think this is my Lululemon stuff. It is. So from Lululemon, I just ordered a ear warmer, head warmer. What do you want to call these things? These are great for if you are just out and about and you don't feel like wearing an actual hat. But if you're like me, you get um, ear pain because I do. I get pain in my ears from them being cold. So I need something like this to keep my ears warm because otherwise I get in, like really bad ear pain from the cold. It's the worst thing ever. So this is just amazing. And you can also wear it when your hair is up, which is really beneficial for me because sometimes I want to wear my hair up and then I'm like, but my ears will get cold. So I have to wear a beanie now. So now I've got to get down. And it's just like a whole, a whole thing, a whole ideal, a whole ordeal that I go through. So I picked this up, super warm. And then I also got a pair of mittens because I had no mittens in this house, okay? There was none. So I picked these ones up for the dog walks this winter to keep my hands warm. And they have the peel back little finger area, which is great for giving treats, opening poo bags, using your phone, whatever it may be, you have that option. So I loved that. Let's do the last thing, which are my new winter boots. I needed new winter boots because last year I just used the winter docks all season, like Doc Martens. And those are great for like the city and like going to get coffee, but they're not gonna be ideal for walking Millie 
in a blizzard, okay? They're just not the right shoes. So I was like, it's about time I get a new pair of snow boots. I had some Torrells years ago, but they ended up just kind of, I mean, they fall apart eventually, and I did wear them a lot when I had them, so it's about time that I got a new pair. And you guys, if you're not from Canada, you're like, why would you need one of these? Because I live in the Arctic tundra, where it gets so freaking cold. So it is necessary. So I picked up these. These are my new winter boots. I think that they're so nice. They're, I'll link the exact ones down below if you guys are from Cold Climate too. I did order these a full size up for me. So one size larger than I normally would be because you know, they are a winter boot. They're super fuzzy inside. And I wanted to make sure that they would fit okay because the last thing I want, and they do look kind of small, I'm not gonna lie. These are a size seven. So I'm gonna try them on and see if they fit. Yup, that was perfect. I had ordered the six. These puppies would not have fit, <laughs> okay? Even a six and a half. A seven, my toe is literally like comfortably at the end of my shoe. Okay, these are gonna keep me so warm and I loved the tread on them. Like, you see that? We are not falling this year. They're super warm, fleece lined, waterproof, all that jazz. <laughs> Winter boots, love that for me. <laughs> And yeah, that's literally everything I picked up. So basically it's like a winter accessory haul, winter clothing haul, just winter stuff haul. Yeah, quite pleased with everything, quite pleased. Everybody. It is a rainy, miserable day, but it also gives me like fall cozy vibes, so I don't completely hate it. But I'm wearing my new sweater, literally obsessed with it. I want to get the Colorado one now too because it's so comfy and cozy. I'm also actually wearing the leggings too, and they're so thick and warm. Airy is where it's at, okay? For like comfy, cozy clothes, they know what they're doing. But I went grocery shopping this morning, picked up a bunch of stuff that I needed for the week. I got some more fruit, some snacks. I'm all set for this weekend and stuff. Aiden's coming here tomorrow. We're gonna have a really fun weekend. Um, I got invited to this little tree lighting, festival of lights thing in Vaughn, which we're gonna go to on Saturday and Millie's coming too. And I'm really excited. I feel like it's gonna be a lot of fun and really cool experience because i've never been to anything like that so it should be really cool but yeah today's just kind of like a rainy ass day that i'm just gonna be working from home doing some editing they're supposed to test the fire alarms today which i'm not excited about that you know usually it's not even that bad they test it for like one minute i swear i also well no i was gonna say i washed floors but they're just gonna get so dirty today because I, I try and wipe off Millie's feet, but there's only so much you can do with dogs. My floors are always dirty now, which is why I always have slippers on. I asked for a new pair for Christmas this year because these ones have gotten so much wear. They're pretty beat up and flat. I need like a new, more heavy duty pair of slippers for around the house. But yeah, happy Thursday. I hope you guys are enjoying this little weekly vlog. Also, I forgot to mention that I canceled going to the gym today and tomorrow. I'm gonna go on Saturday because I'm so sore. <laughs> okay, I haven't worked out in so long. So me doing that leg day that I did the gym and then following that with the Lagree Pilates situation. Um, yeah, my legs are sore, my butt is sore. Like a good sore though. Like I, it means I worked well and like I feel good. But I was like, I don't wanna push myself too much 
that I injure myself because, you know, especially when you're doing like a comeback to fitness, I like to do it slow and gradual because I have been that person who goes in 100 after not working out that much and <laughs> it's never turns out well, never turns out well. So we're taking it slow, we're taking it slow, but I'm excited. I've just been re-watching some episodes of The Crown. This is like one of my favorite shows Netflix ever made. I think it's so good. I cannot wait for the next season to come out. Season five, I think it's coming out in 2022. I'm very excited, but I'm just kind of looking out at the weather right now because I need to go in my video again and it's disgusting. It's disgusting. It literally, yeah, I'm getting a chill just looking at this weather. Like, there could not be anything less ideal than um, just pouring rain. You know? <laughs> like, I'm ready for the snow. The snow at least is cleaner. I mean, slush isn't, but snow, fresh snow is nice. Fresh snow is nice. The ground's frozen, it's not muddy. This kind of weather is horrendous. I'm also super excited because I just booked a little birthday getaway for me, Aiden, and Millie in April. Um, I definitely, I always book like way out for my birthdays because Airbnbs and stuff book up so fast, especially in like cottage country, even in April, it's like nuts and it's slim pickings, especially ones that are pet friendly. But I found a really nice one and we're just gonna go for the weekend. My birthday's on a Saturday this year, well, next year. And I'm just really excited to be able to spend my birthday up north in nature and just like relax. I don't really feel like partying anymore. <laughs> I just not my like ideal way to spend my 27th birthday. Like I want to just be in nature with Millie and Aiden, go for some nice walks, even if it's raining and just be outside, be cozy. That's kind of my ideal situation. So I'm very excited. We can go on like a nice nature hike or something and it'll just be really fun. So I booked that and I'm pumped about it. But I think I'm gonna go let Millie out again right now. Oh God, this weather. I'm like, should I put her rain jacket on? <laughs> she like love hates it. Like I feel like she doesn't completely hate it, but she definitely does not love it either. I also got her little boots <laughs> for the snow. Oh, her boots are right here. I'm losing it. I'm losing it. I got her these little boots from Canada Pooch because in Toronto they have like a lot of ice, snow, and they salt a lot and it's really hard on their feet. So I'm gonna have to train her to like these. A lot of dogs in Toronto wear these kind of like little booties to protect their paws because the salt can really like dry them out and make them crack and it's just not ideal for them. So I'm like, look at these little boots. <laughs> She's gonna absolutely hate these until we get her used to them. She's gonna be like, what the hell are these things? But she's gonna thank me when her little paws don't have salt and they don't hurt. What's wrong with you? You still have energy. I just let you out and the energy is still there? Wow, okay, play session is in order then I suppose. Someone still has energy. Good morning guys, I totally forgot to end off last night's this vlog last night. I went to bed and forgot about it. So it's the morning. Millie woke me up at like five in the morning this morning, but she was a good girl and I put her back in her crate and she slept again until 6.40. So I feel feeling good. I didn't wake up at five. I got a little bit more sleep, so that feels good. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. This is the last video you're gonna see from me until Vlogmas starts on December 1st. So stay tuned for that. My sink is like dripping, do you hear that? But yeah, I'll see you all in my next video. Say bye, Mill. Say bye, Millie. She wants down. <laughs> she still hasn't figured out how to jump down off the couch, but yeah. Bye.